Hi, I'm Drew Moyer, and this is how to find the circumference of the Earth using the angle of the moon. So let's take a look at our picture. Here we have the Earth, and here we have the moon. And let's say the moon is about 0 0.69 degrees below the Earth, which I can denote by drawing this dotted line right here. And the bottom half of the angle is actually going to ma be made with a tangent line between the Earth and the Moon, and that's going to be important later. But what it really starts with is that circumference is equal to 2 times pi times r. And so I know that working backwards, I'm going to have to get to this if I want to get the circumference of the Earth. So really what I'm going to be looking for is the radius of the Earth. So that's what I'm going to be trying to prove. So I'm given the radius of the Moon is 1738, and I also know the different, uh, distance between the Earth and the Moon at their centers, which is 384,400 kilometers. So the key to this proof really starts by dividing this strange shape here into two shapes that we do know. And if I draw this from the center of the Moon so that it's perpendicular to the Earth's radius, Instead of that weird shape I was talking about, I now have a rectangle and a right triangle. And I know that this part of the rectangle must be the same as the moon's radius, which is 1738. So I have part of the Earth's radius. Now I need to find this part right here. And since these two lines must be parallel, and they're cut by this transversal, I know that, because of alternate interior angles, that this angle right here must be the same as this angle, so it's 0 0.69. And now I can use a trig function to solve for x right here, because I have the hypotenuse of my right triangle, and I have the side that I want, and I have an angle. So I'm going to use the sine of 0 0.69 is equal to x over 384,400. And if I solve that out, I am going to get x to equal approximately 4,629 kilometers. 4,629. So now I have both parts of my radius. I have my 4,629 and my 1738. And if I add them together, I'm going to get the radius of the Earth, which is 6,367 kilometers. So now I have my radius that I was missing to solve for the circumference, which I'm going to be able to put in now, and it equals about 39,985 kilometers. So there's our circumference. So I'm Drew Moyer, and this is how to find the circumference of the Earth using the angle of the moon.